This lesson describes the comparison process of two video sequences using the VQMT tool. The comparison is performed using three metrics. PSNR metric is calculated for all supported color components. MSE is calculated for YUV color components. And structural index is calculated for the luminance component. The first way to perform comparison is to use graphical user interface. In this case, you should first specify original video file, compressed video file, choose comparison metric and color component, enable generation of comma separated values, video visualization files, and then press process button. As you can see, graphical user interface allows processing of only one color component and metric at a time. Thus, in order to perform the total comparison, you should repeat the steps 11 times, according to the number of color components and metrics. So, graphical user interface is not the best choice for this comparison. The second way to perform this comparison, which is more appropriate for this case, is to use command line tool. The comparison is started by executing the batch file. One calculations are finished. Video visualization files are generated for each metric and color component, and two comma separated values files are generated. First one contains average metric values, and second one contains metric values for each color component and frame. Let's consider the contents of this batch file. Here is the path to the command line tool. Here is the first argument which is the original video and these are the parameters necessary to read YUV file format. This is the second video argument which is compressed video. Here is the first metric to be calculated. It should be calculated for all color components. Here is the second comparison metric. It should process YUV color components. And the last metric is SSIM precise. It should be calculated for luminance component only. This parameter enables the generation of comma separated values file, which will contain frame by frame metric values. This parameter defines the name of comma separated values file, which will contain average metric values. And this parameter enables the generation of video visualization files. And now let's consider in more details the generated files. This is the video visualization file for MSE metric calculated for U color component. Luminance here designates the difference amplitude between pixels from two compared video sequences. This is the example of PSNR video visualization file calculated for R color component. The color here designates the difference between pixels. And this is the video visualization file for SSIM metric calculated for luminance color component. Luminance values here designates the amplitude of pixels difference. Also, two comma separated values files were generated. These files can be opened in almost any program, such as MATLAB or Excel. Now let's open this file in Excel. Columns here contains the information about calculated metric and color component, two compared video sequences, average metric value for this color component and video sequence, and frame by frame metric values. A simple graph can be easily constructed here. Values along horizontal x correspond here to the number of frame. Values along vertical x correspond to the metric values. You can see that the highest values here correspond to MSE measure calculated for luminance color component and here are the rest of metrics calculated for other color components.